Hey there, this is Sahi from Techie Tweaks. Welcome to my channel and this new video. Uh, in for this video, I have received a lot of request that how to flash any kernel. And today in this video, I will show you how to flash double to tap uh, add double to tap functionality in our device. So for that, first you have to install the file zip and place in it in your internal as you can see I have placed it here zap.tauchon.b1.z then you have to reboot to recovery reboot please guys bear with me as I am doing this handheld because my tripod has been damaged so please bear with me so I will continue once this my device reboots to recovery once you have done uh, came to recovery click on this install zip option if you have installed it in your internal SD card click on first option and locate where it is I have this here so I will click here oh, oops just a minute second actually I am doing it wrong so click on this install press on back button click on reboot system now and don't uh, take your battery out in this rebooting process you have to wait for a minute or two it will not take too long so I will continue once it reboots now my device is rebooted so now you must have an app installed known as thunder zap control by Varun Chitre you just need that app so open that app it will take to some time actually click on this screen option and enable this double tap to wake functionality and glove mode actually this glove mode doesn't work I don't know why but it got disabled by itself and now we have enabled this double tap to wake and check this out as you can see we have waked our device by just double tapping on our screen and you can see that no proximity sensor is working right now you just need to double tap on your screen like this as you can see one another feature which I have uh, actually accidentally uh, discovered is that at a venue tap four times like this it uh, not this time it happened but uh, it will uh, turn the screen off and on very fastly and you can see just the time as you can see very useful feature is this and another thing I have noticed with this kernel is uh, the battery life is affected but not so much affected by this uh, uh, new kernel the screen on time that I am getting is around three and a half hours and uh, the performance and the multitasking on this kernel is also great so thanks guys for watching this video don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button thank you for watching it's Sahib from Techie Tweaks signing off. Thanks for watching.